Chris Neal added another victim to his hit list Thursday night at Scotiabank Place, but this one didn't come without debate. His second period check on Tampa rookie defenseman Victor Hedman was all the rage today following practice at Scotiabank Place. There was plenty of debate in the Tampa room about whether the check was clean or not. As far as the Senators are concerned, there's not really anything to talk about. He's got to play that way. I thought it was a very good hit. Clean, shoulder, wasn't a headshot, didn't leave his feet. He has to make that hit. I'm not uh, concerned about it. Uh, you know, I see a lot worse stuff go on. Like you look at the the last uh, minute of uh, the Tampa game, our last 10 seconds. Uh, one of the guys cross checks me right in the face. That's dirty. You know, uh, you get a cross check right in the chin. Uh, you get split open for stitches. You know, that's pretty dirty. Uh, you know, a clean body check. That's what we want in the game. Another player who came up big in the club's 3-2 victory over the Lightning was center Jason Spezza. Returning after taking a week off and missing two games with an undisclosed injury, Spets had three points, including the winner. You know, the time off helped me a lot. It helped me physically and helped me mentally, too. I think when you grind it out and you're not scoring, you're pressing a little bit, so it kind of got my mind off things, and I kind of came into last game just thinking it was going to be a fresh start, new year kind of for me, and the team had done really well, and, and we'd been good, but you know, I wanted to get on the board, so... Uh, you know, hopefully I can start feeling better physically and keep things rolling. The challenge gets a lot more difficult for the Senators Saturday night at Scotiabank Place as they host Martin Brodeur and the New Jersey Devils. For Sun Media, I'm Bruce Garriott.